Hi y'all, I'm Ryan and I'm part of Texas Impact's digital support team. Welcome to part four of our video tutorial series, Twitter for Advocacy. In this video, I'll be showing you how to set up a Twitter account on your smartphone. First, you're gonna need to download the Twitter app from your app store. I've already done that, so you can see the icon up in the left-hand corner of my screen. I'll click that icon to open the app, and you'll see that we're prompted to create an account. So I'll click that blue button, Create Account. Now I'll enter my name, phone number or email, and date of birth. Now I'll click the next button and we'll be prompted to customize your experience. Twitter wants to track what websites you go to frequently so that it can decide what it wants to show you in your Twitter feed that it thinks will be the most interesting to you. And you know, I'm gonna leave this checked so I can see what Twitter wants to send me. I can always uncheck it later. I'll click next there. And then we are prompted to make sure that this is all correct information. It is correct. So I'll click sign up at the bottom. Twitter now sends me a six digit code that I need to enter to complete the process. I have my email pulled up already. So I'll put in the code that I was just sent and click next again. Now, Twitter is prompting me for a password. This needs to be eight characters long. So I will choose one now and press next. To select a profile picture, click this blue plus button right by the gray circle icon. That will allow you to add a photo from the photos you have in your phone. Before you can proceed, you'll need to allow Twitter access to your photos. I'll do that, and then it will open up my photos so I can insert the one I want for my profile. I'll click Apply, and now that's my profile picture. I could edit it before I press Done, but I'm happy with it just like it is. I'll click Done. I like how it looks as an icon, so I'm going to hit Next. Next, we're prompted for a 160 character bio. That's not enough characters for your whole life story. I'm just going to say digital advanced team member, social media educator, democracy expert, and hashtag text ledge and then I'll press next. Now, Twitter will prompt us to look through what we're interested in and click on that content. Since your Twitter account will be used primarily for advocacy, US national news and politics are great choices. Next, Twitter populates the accounts that it thinks we would be most interested in based on the topics that we selected. I will click on the first 10 accounts that come up as an example. Now, I don't like having notifications on my phone, so I'm going to press skip for now. But if you would like to be notified anytime someone tweets you or sends something to you as a direct message, you can click allow notifications. This is what your home feed looks like on your phone. Instead of having a navigation menu to the left and an explore menu to the right, like on a computer desktop, all you see is your Twitter feed. Your Twitter feed is everything that those 10 people we just followed have published, plus paid Twitter ads. Now, to get to my profile, I'll click on the three blue lines in the top left-hand corner above the little photo that I chose for my profile picture. I'll see my navigation menu here, and if I click on my profile icon, it takes me to my full profile. Now, down here in the bottom right-hand corner 
you see a little blue circle with a plus notification and what looks like a feather. You've probably guessed that it's supposed to be a quill, like a quill pin. That is where you go if you wanna post a new tweet. I'll click that now, and I'm prompted to type the text right in the same caption with, what's happening? For this tweet, I'm going to write, I'm ready to work for justice at the Texas Capitol. And then I'm going to tag Texas Impact. I'll do that by typing an at symbol and then T-X-I-M-P-A-C-T. I will click tweet in the upper right hand corner and there we have it, our first tweet on our phone. Now you know how to tweet. Be sure to check out Texas Impact's Faith in Democracy playlist on YouTube for other videos that will help you make the most of your new Twitter account. See you on Twitter.